that I'm going to take with my fork. Here we go. And we're going to, of course, remove the paper that we have all around. Just like that. We're going to take the ice cream and we're going to dip it into melt dark chocolate. Going to remove the excess of chocolate. Just like this. Then I'm going to remove the fork really slowly. There we go. And the other, same way. Really gently. Perfect. I'm going to keep my ice cream chocolate into the freezer and we're going to move on with the recipe with our lettuce straight from the market. But I'm going to dip into white chocolate that I'm coloring in green. So make sure that you dip the leaves all of the chocolate to cover it really well. Perfect. So I'm going to put my leaves into the plate. Here we go. We have now a thick layer of chocolate. We're going to put our lettuce into the freezer. So I made some just before because we need to let that set at least an hour in the fridge to be able to remove the lettuce from it. Now we're going to use our potato chips that I'm going to smash. That's perfect. And we're gonna use the brioche dough that we make. I'm gonna shape it like a nice little bowl like that and put it directly into the chips and the chips. Here we go. So now we're gonna be able to remove the brioche. We're gonna save the crumbs if you want to have like crunchy in your salad or to use for recipes, don't, you can use it. It's really, really nice. There we go. So we're gonna leave our brioche like this and we're gonna move right there to work with our jelly. Here we go. And we're gonna complete it with water. So this is boiling water that we're gonna use. I'm just gonna close the box and shake it to mix the powder and the water together. We're gonna put it into our fridge to set at least an hour. And in the meantime, we're gonna cook our brioche in the oven for 20 minutes. So now we're going to build our burger. So I have all my ingredients next to me. I'm going to start with the bread. There we go, it smells really good. My chocolate ice cream stack. We're going to move to the lettuce and we're going to add a slice of our jelly tomato. Really good. And we're going to finish with the bread just like that. And our burgers are ready to eat.